What brings you to the battery show? So we've been speaking about our Stereax solid state battery technology, which is used to power sensors for applications in the Internet of Things, but um, also in automotive, and this is primarily an automotive show. And um, what changes do you think you've seen in the energy storage in the EV industry in the last five years? Well, I think uh, the time for electric vehicles has really come. Uh, it's been sort of prophesized for many years, but I think we're starting to see a much greater degree of interest in EVs, hybrid vehicles, and also ultimately autonomous vehicles. They scare me. <laughs> Um, why is the European market so important to your business? Well, the European market is one of the biggest global markets, also one of the most innovative. Some of the world's leading technology companies are based in Europe. So uh, we thought a presence here at the show this week was very important for our business. And have you, what sort of people have you been meeting here? We've been meeting a wide range of different organizations. Uh, we've been meeting fellow technology developers uh, with whom we have a lot in common and we're talking about corporations. We've also been talking to potential customers, so uh, Tier 1 and also OEM organizations from the automotive supply chain um, and also even investors. Graham, if you could just tell us a bit about what, what you've got in your hand there. Yes, thank you. So this is a small photovoltaic panel that harvests light energy and turns that into an electrical current, which is then stored in this solid state battery. This is one of our Stereax M250 batteries. And that ensures that this electronics can be powered in the evening as well as during the day. And the electronics is a small sensor for measuring temperature, a PMIC, which is a power management chip, and a small radio transmitter chip which sends data over a BLE or low energy Bluetooth network to a device like a smartphone or a mini tablet.